what is going on guys today I have an eBay lot uh, this is just kind of a cheap pickup nothing too big uh, I got these one of them was two dollar two dollars and one of them was only a dollar got combine shipping for them there's some nice cards in here nothing too huge uh, sorry I haven't posted in a while I haven't really found any uh, good eBay lots to buy because all of them keep going for like money I don't want to spend on them for the type of players that are in them and if the lighting's bad, I apologize. It was a kind of a rainy day today, so the lighting's not the best. So, first one we got here is a nice Dalvin Cook card on it. For my PC. Uh, like I said, most of these cards are just like Score, Chronicles, Prism from like a year or two ago. So, nothing too big, but it's a fun lot. This first card, we got a Dalvin Cook. Uh, Chronicles. I don't really know what like a pink parallel, I guess you could say. It's a nice one. Second card we got is a Tua Tagovailoa Emergent Prism. It's a sweet one. First Prism rookie card I have of them, technically. So I couldn't find any. Uh, so, like I said, some of this is just like low end score. As you can see, this little sleeve on here is like really tiny. <laughs> So there's a score team of Justin Herbert, uh, Purple Parallel. I think these are hanger box exclusives. Uh, Nick Chubb. This is a red. You can kind of see the red right there. From this year's uh, Collegiate Graphics. A Quidi Pay Draft Class rookie card. There's a nice one, Travis Etienne. Score rookie card. Too bad he hurt his foot or like did, like sprained it. I don't even know what he did to it. I think he like tore a ligament or something. But drafted him on my fantasy team, so that's not very good. Uh, here's a nice one. A Zach Thomas, 2018 certified certified diamonds, numbered. So the other other way. Uh, 58 of 99. It's a cool one. Put, put that one in the numbered card pile. Here's another numbered card. Uh, Todd Gurley. Red. Uh, 428 out of 460. I have a Joe Burrow just like this. We got a T. Higgins playoff rookie card. Another product that I didn't find this year at all. Uh, Aaron Rodgers contenders. Just base card. I like this prism stuff. Uh, James Connor, uh, what is this called again? Green. Okay, I don't remember what it's called. It doesn't say. It's a cool card. Green laser. I think that's what it's called. Maybe pulsar. Yeah, pulsar. That's what it's called. Next, we got a Christian McCaffrey red parallel. This is a really sweet one. Select Joshua Kelly die cut. This is just from retail, which is they just massively overprinted as a concourse. I'm not even going to ever buy that product because they probably made like more than the score. <laughs> uh, Mark Brunel. Oh, this is like an orange, orange uh, prism. Not numbered or anything. Another sweet Pulsar card. Melvin Ingram from Prism. Uh, we got Joshua Kelly from Optic, rated rookie. Jason Huntley, uh, Pulsar. Um, doesn't look like, doesn't look like it's numbered at all. And last card we got a Henry Ruggs uh, Re Legacy rookie card. So that'll do it for lot number one. Uh, this one was the one I got for a dollar only, so that was really cool. I think it was like a buck, something like that. To be honest, I don't really know, remember all the cards I got, I just kind of bid on it because I just saw the value in it, so, yeah. First card we got is a Lawrence Taylor Select uh, 2020, just a base card, I think. You now it's Premier Level. I don't know what all these subset things are called in Select. 
uh, Brian Edwards Omega card, rookie from Chronicles. Uh, James Morgan, Gridiron Kings. There's a nice one, LaVisca Chenault, Elite Series Rookies out of Optic. It's a cool one. Uh, Troy Aikman, uh, Red Parallel. This is a really sweet one. I love these, these shock ones. Darrington Evans. Prism. It's, I'm going to definitely put that on a top loader. Uh, Brian Bosworth, Pulsar. Uh, Henry Ruggs, Crown, Crown Royale, Subset, and Chronicles. Love these cards. Uh, T. Higgins, uh, Great Iron Kings from Chronicles. Earl Thomas, Silver from Prism. It's a cool one. Uh, Denzel Mims, uh, Don Russ Clearly. I think that's what it's called. Uh, it doesn't say that, but I think it's what it's called in basketball. And then here was the Patrick Mahomes, the one I, the uh, one I, this one that caught my eye in the lot. I mean, anything Mahomes goes for a lot of money, and this one's a pink parallel, so that could go for a few bucks maybe. So that's what caught my eye in this lot. Put that in the good pile. Uh, Quentin Nelson, red, white, and blue prism. These cards are really cool. I wish I got some of this in retail, but yeah, I didn't, of course I didn't find any. Van Jefferson, a uh, hollow from Optic. This card could go up in value if uh, he starts because uh, Josh Reynolds left. Next level stats, Derrick Henry. Uh, what's it called? Yeah, red, red parallel, red border, whatever. Fletcher Cox, Silver, Prism. It's cool. I like I love these Prism cards because I never get to see a lot of them. Yeah, this one was this one was on the front page. Uh, this also caught my because it's a die cut from Select, and these usually are low numbered, but it's Marcus Mariota. It's numbered out of ninety nine. So that's cool. Seventy six ninety nine. Let me straighten that pile up. And then this one caught my eye too. A lot of cards that catch my eye, but I saw this was first year Prism, but it was Danny Amendola, 2012. But it's really off centered though. Look how thick it is on this side. And that year he only had five catches for 45 yards, which is pretty was pretty amazing, right there. <laughs> So that will be it for this video. Uh, like I said, just small lot, just like nothing big, just a lot of base cards. But overall value, I probably, I would say, earned like five to ten dollars off of what I bought. So it was it was just fun cards too. I mean, I don't go for big cards; I just go for small cards and like small profits. But yeah, that will be it for this video, guys. Hope you enjoyed. Uh, have a great rest of your day. Peace.